What's going on YouTube? I just wanted to make a super quick tutorial to show you how you can make a note with an image in Excel. So here you can see we have self G8 with the note of being an image of a paperclip. So here we have cell G10 with a the text note inside. So to make the comment or or note with an image in it, we're going to go to the review tab. Then uh, in the middle right, there's going to be notes. Click new note. It's going to default to being blank and having your name in it. I'm going to delete my name. Next, I'm going to want to highlight it over one of the little squares, one of the little squares on the edge. And we want to make sure that we have the icon that looks like you're going to expand the comment before we right click, which is the next step, which is just basically the line with the two arrows on either end. This is important because as you can see, and for example, if I click inside, if I right click inside the comment, and then the next step is to go to format control. As you can see, there aren't many options as you're editing the text. So to make sure that you that the icon is looks like you're going to, going to be expanding the the box before you right click, so then go to format control format comment. Then when you go to colors and lines, and under the very top there's a fill option, and then there's color. But instead of changing the the color of the fill, we're going to change it to an image. So we're going to click the drop to menu. At the very bottom there's fill effects. Then to the right, there is picture. Where here is where we're going to select the image that we're going to replace for the comment. So select picture. And we, after you click select picture, you are different options to where you can get the image from. So for example, you, you simply you can look up an image up on Bing and get one online if you want to. Um, well, for this example, I'm going to be getting one off my computer. So from file. Paperclip PNG, and there there are a couple different options that you can kind of mess around with. So, for example, you can like lock the picture aspect ratio to make sure that to make sure that the picture doesn't warp at all whenever you um whenever you go to resize it. Okay, okay, and as you can see, we have a comment with an image in it or no. And as you can see, we can resize this and move it around until it looks like the way that we want it to. Yeah. Another note: you can actually comment. You can you can actually copy and paste these comments. Um, so Control C, and then here beneath this we have cells one one. We have cells with one through five in them. We're going to highlight over these cells. We just basically just Control Shift down. Then we are going to right click, paste special, and then we're going to go to the bottom after this is highlighted to where it, where it says paste special again. And and then we want to click the box where it just says copy notes, it's comments and notes, where this would just basically only paste the comments and notes. And as you can see, the comment that was that was right here is now copied and pasted here. And another thing to note is that as you can see, they're all visible right now. You might not always want this. So you can go to review notes and then you can have show hide all notes, which will toggle between having all the notes, not notes, not showing at all or the notes showing. And you can also adjust it for individual cells. So as you can see, picking that one more time, no notes are shown. We can go over just this one, one cell right above show all notes. There's show hide note, which just basically does it for an individual cell. Um, so with that being said, I really hope that you all found this to be helpful. Please like, subscribe, and comment as, as any support is extremely helpful for this channel. Um, let me know if you have any questions or comments, and thank you so much for watching. Um, you all have a great day.